Hello guys, welcome to Start for Tutorials. In this session, we will be discussing about calculating the frequency of an RCC building using eigen again value extraction method. So let us begin the session. This method is a little different when compared to rally method. So we will compare the results of the rally method with eigen value extraction method on the same structure so we'll just design the same structure twenty four six base three one bay one second twenty four and six base apply transferring this to main start pro screen well in eigenvalue extraction method basically you need to check out is the density of the material you are using zero point three by zero point three for beams once we are done with the density property the next one is you can see in start editor the density is 23.5616 well the next important property is going to commands miscellaneous cutoff mode shape well the default is six numbers mode shapes but we will be considering up to 8 select ok it means it in the results it displaces 8 mode shapes now we will lift it to 8 stories now going to supports as usual fixed support coming to loads and definitions where well frequency is calculated in x and z direction for a plane frame whereas for a space frame it can be calculated in all the three directions so we will be calculating in all the three directions and apart from rally frequency we will be calculating in single load case detail whereas in rally frequency we calculated in multiple for x and z different load cases so select cell fate select factor 1 select x direction y direction and z direction then going for floor loads you give 3 kN per meter square the range of 0 to 21 meters for x direction y direction and z direction well in eigenvalue extraction method basically there are two types of matri matrix involving the first one is stiffness matrix which depends on the physical properties like member properties, sections, etc., and modulus of elasticity. However, mass matrix depends upon the loadings, and the loading in STAD Pro is in the form of weights but not masses. We need to remember that. So, assigning this to the entire structure.
once you are done with the loads you can go to load case one select add select frequency select model calculation select add once you have added the model calculation then you can go to analysis print add close you can run the analysis now so since we given 8 mode shapes we will be given 8 mode shapes along with the frequencies so let us go to output file well let us go to the results you can see eigen solution select eigen solution we are given 8 modes and the frequencies as well as the periods you can see the frequency cycles per second well an extra are also calculated you can see for mode shape 1 there is an 80.33 participation factor in z direction same also in x direction for second mode shape and coming to third mode shape there is none of the directions participating we will be observing the mode shapes in dynamic analysis in post processing So these were the frequencies comparable. So let us go to post processing. Well, you can view the deflection. Now go to the dynamics tab. You see this is the first mode shape with a participation factor of 80.33 in z direction and frequency of 0.767 hertz while well, selecting second mode shape well you can select second mode here in x direction coming to third mode you can see this is the torsional mode and well let us see fourth mode it got fully oriented well you can see the modes in this way the different modes going to animation you can select mode select f apply frames and frames per second speed will be let us keep 65 select apply select ok well you can see the mode shapes as it is moving let us check out the first one well go to scales decrease the mode shape scale then go to mode shapes different mode shapes
well you can select the fourth sixth you know, mode shape select apply so you can see the frequency of the building the dynamic dynamics of the building moving so in this way the frequency in their particular directions can be calculated using eigenvalue extraction method this is the end of the session please subscribe subscribe to the channel for more videos thank you